Welcome back to the channel, everyone. My name is Dar Sloan, your official partnered content creator for Expansive Worlds. And what we're looking at right now is a tunnel, a railroad tunnel to be precise, or any type of cave railroad tunnel that you see in the game, you're probably gonna find a dinosaur bone in. But in case you haven't found them all, I've got your guide right here. And before we pop into it, please do me a favor. Hit that like, subscribe, notify bell. It really goes a long way to help the channel out. We're growing and I'm putting the work in, guys. I am out here fighting the good fight. Listen, I started over and made a, well, I still have my main account, but I created a brand new account from level one because I had guides for Spain and Trosporit, but I didn't have anything for, for this map. I uh, had a few things, but none of the Warden's Favors, and I was lucky enough to not have to do the Warden's Favors because where I played the game early on and they restructured everything, I had like 1,200 and some rep on Golden Ridge because I did missions that you can no longer do and they didn't take our rep away when we did that. So I didn't have to find all these. This is the first time that I've actually found all these uh, Warden missions, Warden's Favors. And we're starting today's guide with dinosaur bones. Please let me know in the comments. I have done them all. I've completed them all at this point. So, but my next decision is because there's 15 of them. There's 15 guides that's getting ready to, to come out. Let me know in the comments which one you would like to see next. Like which is the hardest to find. The dinosaur bones was one that was requested. So I'm going to put this one out. I'm thinking probably Bigfoot or the weather stations or the GPS stations, but you guys let me know which one you want me to put out next. I'm going to put them out and I just don't know what order I'm going to put them out in. So I have found, if you look, we've got 160 rep. That's what you get. That's the only thing I've done so far on this account uh, besides the tutorials. So we did the golden tour. If you do all that, you're going to have 160 rep. So I'm just right here on the map right now. Pretty sure this is a dinosaur bone location. I think this this is one. There was one cave that I found that you couldn't go back into very far and it would have, it was collapsed or whatever and had a dead end and there wasn't dinosaur bones in there. But every cave that I have found, other than that one, there's been a dinosaur bone in. So look for that. But if you're missing some, you'll find one of them or ever how many you're missing in this video because I believe different than the other things that this one is probably just has eight dinosaur bones because there's only so many caves on the map. But the other things, the trees, the flowers, all those other favors that we do, most of them have way more than eight. And it's just when you click on eight, you complete the mission and the other ones won't be glowing anymore. So that's another thing is you know, you got to watch out. Like if you go somewhere and you can't click on it, it means you've already discovered it. Okay. So as you come along these dinosaur bones, if you come to one, look right now and see if you found two or three of them already. And so as you're doing this guide and you go, if it won't let you click on one, it's because you've already found it. So remember that and just move on to the next one. But I hope this guide helps you. Uh, let's hop into it. All right, guys, right here, I just clicked on this dinosaur bone. It was glowing green. We just entered this tunnel. So we are right here um, below Jagged Dewdrop. There's a tunnel, and I'm heading this way. And I saw it glowing and clicked on it. So now it started a new mission, which is the dinosaur bones. So we have to collect seven dinosaur bones. Let's see right there. Sure make a little work about it. Just just inside it here. I think there's a lot of these dinosaur bones in any type of tunnel. I feel like there's some like over in some tunnels over in here somewhere too. But we'll just have to find them. Alright guys, we have looks like probably our second dinosaur bone. Anytime you come across these caves. We usually want to run into one here and we are up here past the waterfall spires drop you got to take this left climb this steep embankment i come around this way we also need to check this road for something it's about anyway we are right here at an intersection how about that let's pick up this dinosaur bone well, let's 
think it's two. What, two dinosaur bones? Yep, that's two. All right, guys, I just saw this cave over here and just figured I would come in here because it seems like any time you see a cave, you're going to get dinosaur bones. Even though it is collapsed, there is one right here. So we are right here above J and D water mule. And we're almost finished unlocking the map. I've got uh, this spot here, which is a lookout tower. It'll add a few more question marks to the map. And then we can start searching for the painting of all these favorites. Now this is going to be our fourth dinosaur bone. As you can see there on the screen, we're tracking it, locate and report dinosaur bones. Number three. This is going to be number four. guys we are right here on the map if you look we're in a tunnel so you can't really see but if you fast travel in here you will see a tunnel and that's where you got to find these dinosaur bones um, so I'm trying to remember some places that I've had seen some tunnels and as I I found the others just kind of there's more railroad tunnels on it through here i went into one and it was collapsed and ended and there wasn't any but i i'm pretty sure i saw some more tunnels over somewhere over through here so any place that there's a tunnel railroad tracks going under a mountain anything like that you can typically find these have been pretty easy because they're just kind of out in the open but the other four we're going to, have to look for a little bit all right sure enough there is a cave here it is right where i thought it would be like right through here well i mean i've actually put the marker right on the <laughs> well that that worked out good but i know there was a cave here uh I'll tell you why i knew i come barreling down through here one time and missed this turn off and ended up flipping down this hill so when you come here on uh because it is listen it's it's a it's a tight turn Right there. So there's dinosaur bone number five. But yeah, uh, it's downhill right here. And I caught some black crappie down there. I remember this well. I come shooting down that and we went tumbling down in there. And I think that it started me all the way back at an outpost and I had to make the trick again. So that's why I remembered this cave. <laughs> so we did get our fifth dinosaur bone there. All right, you can see this cave is a little uh, off the beaten path here. We are up here. It's, it's right in between. I would probably say empty fort. Just go up here, turn left, and come up this way, and there's a cave right here. Um, well, shoot, right there it is. So that is... That is dinosaur bone... Yes, dinosaur bone number six. Two more to go. Sure enough, guys, this is a small little little cave. It's not not very big at all. Uh, you just come in here. We are right here where we just got a spruce. And just to the right of Heritage Vista, just walk down the hill here, there's a little cave right beside this body of water. And right here, it's dinosaur bone number seven for us. That is number seven. So one more to go. We are here staring at our last dinosaur bone. Let me show you where it's at. Right here at Prosperity's Pick Silver Mine. I fast traveled in here to Prismatic Bridge. Came up here and there was a railroad track here. As you can see, we're on it. And I was like, well, I don't know that I've been in that one. I wasn't 100% sure. I thought I had been, but I just figured I would come check it out and sure enough here it is we've got our eighth I think dinosaur bone mission completed so that's all eight there's our reputation all right so that was all the footage that I have just over the days just as I come across stuff recorded and got a lot more footage coming out with all the other ones so if you found this helpful guys please 
hit that like, subscribe, notify bell. Uh, this was a lot of work. I could have been out there catching diamonds on my main account because I still need some, but I wanted to create this guide. Now I feel more complete because I have guides on all the maps and I know the warden's favors is a headache. That is, you know, I like the way they've done the, the second and third map in the game that they've tied most of the stuff just to fishing, which we're going to get into as well. Uh, so I've got some more content coming out on the fishing side of things, but I like it when they tie it to, you know, I, you know, just fishing, you know what I mean? Uh, so, but here's the, the warden favors, dinosaur bones. Let me know in the comments, which thing you would like to see me release next. Cause I have done them all at this point. Um, so let me know which guide do you want to see next? Do you want to see GPS, weather stations, Bigfoot? I've done them all. So just let me know in the comments, which that you like guys. We are streaming now three days a week on YouTube. I'd love to catch you all over in our live streams. Uh, we are streaming three days in a row just to make it simple and not as complicated. Of course, Tuesday nights, which we just won. Uh, Pro XCK coming second. And then I can't remember who got third, but I just barely beat Pro XCK because he caught a diamond at the end. I just beat him by three pounds, but uh, we are the defending champions of Tackle Tuesday, and we had a good week with Camizo. I caught almost a community record diamond Camizo, and then the other four were goads as well. Two of them were almost diamond. So we had a, we had a really good, really good week over on uh, YouTube. So Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and Thursdays is my YouTube times. Or days, Tuesdays, of course, Tackle Tuesday starts at 9 p.m. Eastern Time and goes to 11 p.m. Eastern Time-ish. Sometimes we get started about 10 or 15 minutes late. But uh, especially if someone finds a great one right before two weeks in a row. <clears throat> Crow. But anyway, guys, let me know in the comments what you'd like to see next. Our other two days, Wednesdays and Thursdays on YouTube, we are streaming from 5 to 7 p.m. Eastern Time. We'll catch you in the next video.